Hey there guys, what's up? It's your boy Pixel12 back with another video for you guys on the channel. Today's video is going to be us voting for the Premier League team of the season. So without further ado, I suggest we get right into the video. Right then guys, welcome back to the video. And as you guys can see on my screen, we can vote for the Premier League team of the season, goalkeepers, defenders, midfielders, and attackers. I'm going to be doing this a bit 50-50. So the way I'm going to be doing this, I'm obviously going to rate certain players for their, mainly Manchester United players as I'm a Manchester United fan, on their real life ability based on the games that I've watched. And also doing it kind of like FIFA-esque. So what players would be OP to see for a Premier League team of the season in FIFA. So... Let's get into this. Right, goalkeeper choice. We've got Alisson, Ramsdale, Jose Sa, Ederson, and David De Gea. I have to honestly say, for me, it's going to be David De Gea. Not only is he Manchester United's player of the season, through and through, in my opinion, but he has had an incredible season, stopping an incredible amount of shots. Obviously, that's because our defence leaks like a fucking broken pipe, but it is what it is. We're going to use De Gea, but we're now going to move on to the defenders. So the choice here is between uh, Van Dijk, Robertson, Cancelo, Arnold, Ruben Diaz, Walker, Peters, Matip, Walker, and Romero. I mean, we already know Van Dijk needs to get a card. So he's going to be my first choice. Uh, see, I don't know. I haven't really watched that much of Southampton, so I can't really say anything about Carl Walker, Peters. But I'd like to see him in the game. I think it'd be cool to see. So I'm going to put him at right back, because I think he's a right back in here or right wing back. Trent is, I mean, Trent is Trent in it. He always gets a card. Uh, left back, I'm actually going to go with Cancelo. He's an incredible player. And in centre-back position, I'm going to have to go with... Uh, with uh, actually, no, we're going to go with Joe Matip. I think he's deserved it this year. I think the guy actually deserves to get a good card this year. So that's going to be my back line that I'm going to be voting for for the team of the season of the Premier League. Right, midfielders now. This is where it gets a lot. Like, we've got a lot of players to choose from here. So we've got the Bruyne, Bruno Fernandes, Bernardo Silva, Saka, Wolprouse, Fabinho, Rodri, Odegaard, Rice, Bowen, Rafinha, Gallagher, Benrahma, Gundogan, and Ruben Neves. So for me, this is a big one. Definitely, definitely, definitely would love to see a Rafinha card. So he's going in. I'd love to see that. This is what I mean when I say I wanted to do it kind of like 50-50 split, kind of like some OP cards in FIFA that I'd like to see, as well as actually voting it based on what needs to happen. Then another player which I want to see get a team of season is obviously going to be Martin Odegaard. What an insane playmaker he has become under Arteta at Arsenal. I was watching the Arsenal-Chelsea game the other day, and boy, oh boy, he has developed massively. I'm I'm, I'm happy for him. I, the thing is, I used to I do still have a Real Madrid kit from his first season at Madrid with Odegaard at the back. Obviously, my parents watched it a bit mad, so the writing's come off. But it's still sick. Like, the very first, one of the very first Odegaard kits that I ever really got printed as a big league kit i actually had which is very very cool right i'm obviously going to be harsh here bruno Fernandes does not deserve a team of the season he has dropped off massively he can go do one in my opinions the rest same as the rest of the united squad apart from there right obviously now it's going to become difficult me personally i'd love to vote in declan rice really love to vote in declan rice really love to vote in saka but i'm gonna have to you know what i'm actually gonna go sod it Declan Rice. That's going to be my vote. Deckers. Right, for the attackers now, we've got some good choices here. So we've got Cristiano Ronaldo. We've got Kane, Son, Sterling, Mane, Salah, Foden, Mares, Ivan Tony, Diogo Jota, and Mikel Antonio, the Jamaican beast. So obviously, we already know right wing, left wing, Salah Mane. That's already a given. Going to have to go like that because Liverpool are insane. Now, striker position... I'm going to be a bit biased here. I'm going to have to be a bit biased here. And go Cristiano Ronaldo. Purely because he's had an insane season with two hat-tricks in a shit team. And obviously, it is Cristiano Ronaldo San He has to be in there. He has to be in there. So, with that being said, this this is my vote. Let me know what you guys voted, how you guys voted in the comments. Let Leave the link so I can actually go see them. If you've got any like Twitter links, whatever, put them in the comments because I'm really hyped to see these. I'm going to submit my vote right now. There you go. So, Tots vote. But with that being said, this is going to conclude the video. If you guys have liked this video, please hit the like button, subscribe already. Let me know in the comments, like I said, how you guys voted and what team you guys voted. And I'll catch you guys on the next one very, very soon. Bye!